Hey everyone, my name is today. I'm playing on No L Only W, aka my starting over account. So, right now you can see I'm in a game around like 7:30 p.m. Now, if you guys think this looks a little bit familiar, well, basically what I'm doing is my um, multiple VIP server grinding trick, except I'm gonna do it on my alt with zero game passes. So this is gonna be a bit interesting. So we're starting off at 122,000 money. Okay, 250 cash from Batsy C store, fairly easy. Now that the trains come a lot like less often, it's like from like eight hours, 15 minutes to like nine hours. So we get like a little bit of a time. So the sequence of stores for grinding with multiple servers is a little bit different than like the uh, one used by the rogue person. Instead of going to the train first, you skip the 2.30 train and you go, you start basically at the small source and then catch the 10.30 train. So, other than that, it's basically the same. Once you rob everything once, you just leave the game and go onto another server, which I currently have right here. It's my old account. He's just waiting in-game right there. You can see, so we're just gonna go ahead and just, like, go to the train. So it's currently 12 o'clock a.m. in the game. The train is here. Vehicles, right now, the train will just no-clip through the vehicle, so it won't really matter if you have cars on the train track. So, in this case, like, I have, a uh, zero game passes on here, so basically, I'm gonna rob the trains, like, much faster than I would on my main account, so that means we will definitely have a lot more time than we need in order to get all our money on this server. We might even be able to rob the small stores twice before the other servers are ready, so we're gonna go ahead and just come over here. It's gonna be quick and easy, just like this. 1,400 and 1,500, just like that. And here we go, we get out right in front of the police station right over here. So we're gonna go ahead and just come over here to the jewelry store, go inside. You get ourselves 2,000 cash, it's gonna be quick and easy. And just like that, 2,000 cash, it's fairly quick, you just punch it like 3 or 4 times. Not including the 1, well 3 if you don't include the first punch, 4 if you do. And now we just go through here, it's fairly quick and easy. Use this donut just in case. And then we can just like open these lasers up, jump through here, go through the lasers like this. And now we can go ahead and go to the top. And once we are here at the top, we can just go ahead and just like come back down to this Camaro over here. If you do have the mobile garage game pass, it's, the mobile garage game pass is very underrated at this point. Because the uh, speed boost to the vehicles is actually quite significant. You should probably get it if you have the Robux to do so. Let me know in the comment section of this video if you want me to buy a mobile garage and only mobile garage on here. So that everything else seems like mostly the same as like normal so like money amounts are the same so let's go ahead just come over here to the bank the key card is very useful for the bank but if you don't have any of the game passes i believe you can still punch that i haven't really tested that out since the new update so we're just gonna go ahead and come over here and start the bank and while i'm waiting over there for the bank to open up i'm just gonna grab the heli from my alt and just land it in the yard just like that and now you can see we are now inside of the vault just like this easy peasy and we can just like wait it in here it's not even gonna be that long and it will get 1,000 cash and get out of the bank and just like that 1,000 cash we can now go ahead and just come out of the bank easy peasy fairly simple and there's really no lasers here you shouldn't really have to worry about dying in the bank and then once you do get over here, I'm not sure if the small servers will have money or not, but the other server I am in right now is currently ready, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave this game and join that one. Alright, so right now I'm currently inside of um, this game right here. Now, because I uh, started both these servers about the same time, they're like within an hour in-game time of each one, so we're gonna go ahead and you can see there's a heli here. This heli is free, so that's why I'm using it, because anyone can use this heli. I'm just gonna go ahead and come over here and pickpocket the alt account, get the alt to jump out of the vehicle, and now we can go ahead and come over here, hijack this thing. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and just come over here to Bad CC store. The train after the midnight one will come at around 9 a.m. in-game time, so we should still have enough time to come over here and just rob Bad CC store. Okay, real quick, change of plans. I'm actually gonna go ahead and go for the bank because it is like ever so slightly closer to the uh, main train area real quick. So we're just gonna go ahead and come down here into the bank. We should have like plenty of time. Three in-game hours is gonna be fairly quick, especially when you don't have any game passes because you're only gonna be getting 1,000 money instead of 3K. And while we wait for that bank, we're gonna go ahead and just come over here and grab a helicopter on the alt account right over here you can see just need to fly or jump somewhere around here and now the vault's open we can go ahead and just come here while we collect our money i'm gonna go ahead and just grab this heli real quick so we just climb this ladder come on do not fall off the ladder and here is the heli and we can go ahead and just land it on the floor you can see right over there and now 
we are about to get 1k cash just like that. Once you master like all these uh, multitasking, like two accounts at once, getting money fast is going to be very, very easy. All we got to do now is just come over here. Get back inside our helis. I still do not know why these helis like to rest upside down. Okay, so it's currently 9am. The trains come every 9 hours in this game after the first train around 3pm. So here we go. Whoa, this train is really slidey. Uh, can I go in? Okay, here we go. We are now inside of this train. Now all we gotta do is just open this thing up and open up the side door like that. We can go ahead and just come over here. I believe there's a blue card behind us, so we might have a chance of robbing two trains. And there we go, 1,500. Now we can go ahead and just jump out. Can I get on this train, please? Okay, well, it looks like the train just decided to kind of murder me. So let's go ahead and just come over here, get this jewelry store over with. So the jewelry store is fairly simple. You just start that thing like that and then just punch a few boxes like this. It's going to be fairly quick and easy. Sometimes it takes more than four punches, which for some whatever reason, Bad CC did. And now just to carry out your donut, don't really click until you absolutely have to. So like right over here, you can go ahead and just run through this thing and run through this as well like this. Easy peasy. Parachute sometimes does funny stuff. The parachute does that, then I recommend targeting your vehicle. And then once you realize your parachute is good, you can continue flying. Otherwise, you gotta use your car. So here we go. Just like that, 2,000 cash, easy peasy. So here we go, now this is a, a level 5 Camaro, you can see in here that it is a big difference, it's much faster than the regular default Camaro, although the snowman is a whole lot faster than both of those things. So now we're just gonna go ahead and come here, rob Asimo's store, and there we go, 250 cash, it's still some money, so might as well just take it. I believe we should be able to go back to Bad CC store and rob him again. But here we go, we are now here at Bad CC's donut store, let's go ahead. Come over here and just start a robbery. Bad CC, he should have money. And there we go, Bad CC does in fact have money. So now we are here inside of the alt game. You can hear the helicopter, and that's because I moved it to right in front of the uh, door over here. So that we can just go ahead and come here and immediately just pickpocket this thing and get the alt to like just jump out over there. And I'm just going to click refresh and join the server that my main account is currently not inside, just like that. And while the alt is joining the server, I'm going to come down here to Bad CC store. Once you get like this, I'm switching the servers and the accounts around this thing mastered. It's gonna seem very, very like second nature to you. And there we go, just like that, 250 cash, fairly easy. We don't have that 1M heli yet, so we can't really use it. So we're gonna go ahead and come over to the train area and hope that a non-scam train arrives. So real quick, the train is now coming, we're gonna go ahead and just go inside of the train. So we've currently been grinding for about um, 15 minutes or so, it looks like this train over here is in fact a scammy train. So we're just going to go ahead and go back to the jewelry store and the bank and everything like that. And here we go, now we can just go ahead and just come inside here and just chill. Get ourselves our 1,000 cash from this bank. And there we go, 1,000 just like that. It's fairly quick, fairly easy. So here we go, we just made it outside over here and just grab this heli and now go to the jewelry store. And jewelry store as we expect is wide open. If it isn't wide open then the game is broken so now we can just go ahead and just come inside here and start a robbery and just start punch everything randomly I guess. Let's just go ahead and just come all the way down here, grab this heli and now we can just come to criminal base. Fairly easy. Go rob Asimo and Bad CC stores. Okay, so here we go. Now we can just come over here and take some of Mr. Asimo's money. And there we go, just like that. Asimo does have his share of money over there. I'm not sure if Bad CC did in fact restock or not, so let's go ahead and check on his store. And Bad CC also does look like he has money, so that means his restocking time is about like six to seven hours in a VIP server. I'm not sure about public servers. I don't think that um the uh, stores in here are going to be opening up anytime soon, so I'm going to go ahead and just save me some time on the next game and go ahead and join my alts game and here we go we know it's dinner time so i parked the heli like right outside you can hear the uh, helicopter blades so just like how we used to do we just come over here grab a key card pickpocket him like that and then we can just stand outside here get the alt outside of the heli so because we still have like four to five hours in game time let's go ahead and just take both small source monies and then go to the train so just like how we expected, Bad CC store will have money. We're the only person in here. There's really like no reason why any of the stores won't have money. And just like that, 250 cash. Fairly simple. So it's now 12 a.m. The train is now here. I'm not sure if the train will still kill you, but I'm assuming that it will probably still will. So let's go ahead and just come over here. This is the only red car, so we don't need to worry about robbing more than one red car. Just gonna go ahead and open up this vault, just like this. Fairly easy. And there we go, 1,500, just like that. Here we go, we just made it outside. 
And there's no need to like walk all the way back there. We can now just come grab this um, default card over here. So jewelry store is wide open. Let's just go ahead and come over here and start robbing it like this. Fairly easy. And now we've made it through the top. We can go ahead and just jump. And our parachute did in fact deploy safely. So we can just go directly fly to the criminal base like this. And we can just aim for our vehicle over there. That way we can just drive around and go to the bank. And now I guess we're going to go ahead and just come over here and rob this bank because it's going to be like fairly quick and easy. Bank is 1000 cash. Okay, here we go. The vault is open up. Now we just wait in here and just get ourselves our uh, money like this. And now we have ourselves 1000 cash. So I hope you guys enjoyed this um, VIP server multiple trick on the alt account. We're right here, right at the bank robber. We basically made 20,000 money in basically 30 minutes. That means about like maybe um, 40,000 per hour, which is about the same rate as we would get, like one third of the rate as a uh, person with the bigger duffel bag and VIP game passes. So this is probably still one of the fastest ways to get money. 40k per hour, like 20k per 30 minutes, something like that. Without any game passes, it's absolutely insane. It's what it's still more than what Creecraft gets every live stream inside uh, VIP servers, like how he does it. I don't even know why he does it with like 25 people in the game. So if you guys enjoyed this, be sure to press like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>